We've got a startling admission from the head of the CDC that the agency has made serious mistakes during this COVID pandemic, which has killed more than a million Americans. The U.S. has by far the highest COVID death toll in the world. Dr. Rochelle Walensky is now calling for fundamental change to restore the public's trust as now monkeypox spreads and COVID numbers remain high in some places in the country. She spoke to our Dr. John LaPook in an exclusive TV interview last night. Was the agency up to the task of handling this pandemic? I think our public health infrastructure in the country was not up to the task of handling this pandemic. We have Dr. Rochelle Walensky is vowing to revamp the CDC after its response to COVID-19. We made some pretty public mistakes and we need to own them. This admission came after the CDC received the findings of an external review she ordered of the agency. The CDC says the review found the agency's COVID guidance was confusing and overwhelming. Why did you go ahead and commission this external review? You know, I think it's really important to understand the great work of this agency, but also to admit to areas where we needed to improve. We owe that to the American people. The CDC says its new objectives are to share scientific findings and data faster, translate the science into practical, easy to understand policy, and develop what Dr. Walensky called special forces to fight future pandemics. We do now have an agency that has intense scientific expertise in almost every area of public health, which is a real gift. And what we really need to do is raise those folks outside of their silos. Do you think they're up to the task of now changing their whole culture and thinking of themselves more like special forces that can be deployed wherever they're needed? I have no doubt that they're up to the task. Many say it can't come soon enough as monkeypox cases spike in the U.S. Last week, the FDA authorized a plan to stretch out the nation's limited supply of monkeypox vaccines by offering a way of administering shots at one-fifth the dose while eliciting a similar immune response. Do you think the criticism that the CDC has been moving too slowly in dealing with the monkeypox outbreak, those criticisms are valid? We at CDC still have not seen all the immunization data um, that we need to be able to see in order to mobilize vaccinations across this country. Part of those challenges are similar to some of the challenges that we had with COVID-19, that we don't have full line of sight on all the data that we need in order to make real-time decisions. Dr. Walensky says it remains a global fight to get monkeypox under control. We always have the possibility of receding if we don't have it contained around the world. Back to the old statement, no one is safe until everyone is safe. For CBS Mornings, I'm Dr. John LaPook.